so hello everybody and welcome to today's video today my friends i'm gonna show you how you can um, unlock uh, every hideout in path of exile um, i have a list here of 34 34 hideouts to my knowledge that's all of them uh, uh, but if there is any hideout like missing or something wrong please tell me in the comment section and i'm gonna update uh, uh, that information because i'm gonna just paste that into the description so you guys you can just check out uh, the hideouts and how to get them uh, i'm gonna categorize uh, those hideouts into three categories uh the, the first one are the easy ones okay that's the ones that you find in the acts so and whenever you do this act, that means the, the bathhouse, you will find a luxury uh, hideout. I'm going to show you how to do it because luckily I have noticed that I don't have it. So I'm going to show in this video how to, how to unlock that. Then you got the ones that you find in the map. So it's not that if you do the ivory temple map, you will find the immaculate hideout. No, you will have to run it over and over again until you have the chance or you're lucky to increase encounter it so there are people saying they they have uh, done it like hundreds of, of times and they never never uh, found the hideout so you have to be lucky um and then the third um category is the the ones that you have to buy so whenever it's with an mtx store or the suns uh, the supporter pack so you have to buy or the supporter pack to get the suns pack, or you have to pay for the shaped height out that means mtx that's paid that's the church category so it's not for free so uh but in overall there are 34 hideouts that you can get M myself and if you want to check yeah. which one you have you go to helena in your hideout select hideout and you see it whenever you hover over your hideouts you see over it okay over the image you see found in map tower so the brutal hideout i have found in the tower map Okay, so as you can see here, Luxury's hideout is locked. So we are going to do it so I can show you how to do it. So it's Act 8 in the bathhouse. Bathhouse should be here. Okay, let's go. So basically you will go over the whole map. At the corners or at the walls, there is, at some point, there will, a, a little blue icon is gonna appear and that's where we are going into. So it's not here, so you have to, to, um, to search a bit around until you are lucky and to find that blue icon that I hope I will, oh, I've seen it, it's at the north there there you go you see here top right corner okay that's the icon you want to see in your minimap so basically we go in there is this Helena already like you talk to her or not and then the clear the monsters from the area clear? so we have to kill every single monster in order to unlock this hideout Okay, and you see hideout unlocked. Okay, that that's it. Okay, hideout unlocked. We are done. Now I can go back. We are gonna um, get to our uh, girl Helena that is uh, waiting for us on a, in our hideout. Wait. Okay, Hello. here select hideout and you see the luxurious hideout here it is so we click on it swap and we are already entering that beautiful hideout with all of its um little decorations that are already in it so you can go on so uh for example let's say you are uh, playing your maps and you encounter a hideout mm -hmm. 
So you have six portals. If you unlock that hideout, you have, let's say you have five portals left. You can sell if you want, or you can share this hideout with others. So you can unlock it for you. And then you can uh, just, you finish that hideout or that area, and then you can just invite some people to come over. Even after you have unlocked it, people log in, just get into this blue icon and they get the the, uh, the hideout unlocked for themselves. Uh, so you can share to up to five people whenever you encounter it. Um, I recommend you to, uh, to check the chat, uh, the global chat 820. There is for sure... Um, um, a, co uh, a global chat section only for hideouts but check the 820 I do everything there because there are the most people uh, you can even sell do some currency there are people they are selling some hideouts for pretty good currency uh, there are many people they are really looking for uh, but there is one very very specific um, hideout to my knowledge it's the celestial hideout okay uh, that's the one here that you get in the shapers realm that's the only one that to my knowledge as i said that uh, you can't uh, buy and you can't uh, share with anybody why because it's gonna proc the hideout is gonna proc when you kill the shaper in the shapers realm so uh, you kill him and then something is gonna uh, show up like this hideout unlocked celestial hideout as you can see there is no icon nowhere so it's gonna proc randomly and then it's done okay whenever you um you invite some people or so and they get in here they will not get a hideout so that's the only one the celestial hideout is the only one that to my knowledge that um that you can't buy okay so um i'm gonna show like some of the hideouts okay that was pretty much it how to get them uh, good luck to everybody on on doing that i mean i found it uh, very important to do a video about this if you want to now see my hideouts i mean my uh my hideouts that i have unlocked you can uh, stay here my friends so uh, i'm gonna very fast show you uh, the ones in the maps okay because the, the the ones of the that you find in the in the act i think that everybody will have okay the alpine hideout is a very beautiful one if you like snow and glacial stuff uh, uh, you see that uh, it's a very big one actually yeah. and uh yeah that is uh, a bit like coastal hideout a bit like the the, the how it's it's uh, the map is um, shaped a bit um then we got hello um which one we got the brutal hideout it's also a hideout that you can find as you can see you come here and uh, you you have uh different levels of floors that is also nice if you like it you see with some fire some lava and stuff personally i don't like it that much i love to have everything in one um in one level Hello. and then uh epilogue okay that's when you um finish your axe at the end the coastal hideout that's mine okay this is not the one that uh, you will find whenever you unlock it that's my hideout with all the decorations that uh, took a long time my friends to finish this or to uh, to get it looking like that then we got the enlightened hideout that's a very dark one personally i don't like that much and it's a very small one as you can see with let's say three um different uh rooms um then we got a glacial hideout i think this is gonna be the next one that i'm gonna do here you go it's a very beautiful one i like how it's set okay then with the bridge going over it's a beautiful one I, I like it you see oh 
sorry. <sighs> and then we got... Yeah, the last one that I have from the map maps is the Unearthed. Sorry if I am raping the English language at the moment. Uh, that's the hideout here. It's a very simple one, as you can see, but you can like pretty much do very beautiful stuff look at this crafting bench it's it's just amazing oh every climb no okay whatever so that was it with the last hideout i mean um if you have any suggestions my friends if there is something missing in my uh, video just let me know uh my friends i'm gonna put a list on in the um, description uh, section i'm gonna update whenever people are commenting and stuff if you have any new idea of a guide that i could do that is missing so, uh, in the uh, youtube or so and you want to see it or uh, it's not clear please let me know um for the rest don't forget to like to subscribe and uh, to comment and to yeah subscribe most of it and i am streaming all the time on twitch so if you want to uh, join us and have a little talk and stuff and play even with me uh, just let me know um, all the links are under the description and for the rest thank you so much for watching have a nice day nice night and see us on the next video bye bye my friends i love you bye